seats, heating, controls, massage seats, all controlled up here. So you can put the massage seats on should you wish as well. Yeah, and you say it's Apple CarPlay, yeah? It's it got Apple here. CarPlay, Android Auto, yeah? Hi guys, is your very own homie Dr. Kewe. I've come to test drive, test drive the Range Rover Sport today. A, a friend of mine, like my brother here, says if I drive the Range Rover Sport, I'm not gonna step my feet into a Benz anymore. So I thought I'll come give it a go. So come with me on this test drive of the latest uh, that is the 2024 Range Rover Sport and let's see how it goes obviously you all know that I'm into my Mercedes and if you haven't seen the video of the CLA Premium Plus Midnight Edition that I'm currently using you can click back to the videos and you should see that but I just want to see what the Ring River Sports is like today yeah so this is the Range Rover in my little corner of Somerset we're just waiting to catch up on the truck Has look blood though. My man calls this a big body range. It's 2024, but we're here for the spot today. Oh gosh, it's got nice, nice open roof, hasn't it? Say no more. Say no more. Say no more, mate. Loving it already. Is there any particular reason? That's called the autobiography. So it's the designation of the model range. This one's the top specification. Oh, okay. Gosh. Oh my God. Yeah, that carbon fiber is crazy. Oh, uh, okay. 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 And this one's the petrol, yeah? It is. Yes. This one's petrol plug in hybrid. It's free to. Petrol plug-in hybrid. Ooh. Full option. Well, the interior is sick, isn't it? Yeah, absolutely. Oh my god. It's got the electric buttons and everything, isn't it? Yes. Easy touch. It's quite spacious, yeah? No, absolutely. Like, can you open the back? Yeah. So, so much space. Oh, That's yeah. Nice. Legroom is crazy. Yeah, the fabric is, the finishing is excellent. Oh. Love it. And what's the boot capacity, do you know? Well, I can go and get the exact specification of the website yeah. for you. Oh, yeah. I'll try and find that out for you in two moments. Okay. This plug in hybrid is crazy. Well, oh gosh. It's good size, isn't it? Amazing, amazing. Okay. It's got the bottom thing here where you can stock in a few things. Nets on the side. Yeah. And this one's the open roof and with the Range Rovers the open roof is full length, isn't full it? Length. Down to the back. 
Yeah, which is something that the Mercedes doesn't have. We're going to go on a test drive, you know, just to see how this feels on the legs and on the hands. And then can come back to have a chat with... No, this one is this one is blood clot. This one is blood clot, mate. Carbon fiber is something else, man. Oh my god. How many inches is this tire? Twenty-three inch. The rim is twenty-three, yeah. Massive, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Well, the car is a specimen, mate. <laughs> no, the car is a specimen. No, don't play. Don't play. The car's posh. It is posh. Seats, heating, controls, massage seats, all controlled up here. So you put the massage seats on should you wish as well. Yeah, and you says Apple CarPlay, yeah? It's it got is, Apple yeah. CarPlay, Android Auto, yeah? Yeah, the infotainment is crazy. All wireless, yeah? Yeah, certainly. Mm. And then in there is your fridge. Is that a fridge? Yes, yeah. You don't say. Wow. It's luxury, isn't it? And the wireless phone charger, just back there. Oh, really? Yeah, sure. Have you been thinking of changing your vehicle for a little while now then? Or? Well, I just got this one in April, like I said, yeah. and the space isn't working out for me. So that's why I'm thinking of you know, change into something. Actually have the GLC Coupe in mind. Yeah. Because that's the one I used for four years. Yeah, yeah. You got what I mean? I always get it brand new. So, but my friend says, you know, Range Rover is more like it. And it is looking like it is. Yeah. <laughs> it's, 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 looking, it's looking like, gosh, the open roof is, did you know, I love the full length of the open roof. It's beautiful. Oh, all the way to the back. Compared to the Mac, that's just, you know. Yeah. Oh, wow. It's noiseless. It's so, so quiet. Is it because it's the plug in hybrid, yeah? It is. Yeah. Do you feel like the petrol has a, a little bit of noise or is it it's literally still, the same it's, thing? It's moving, it's quiet, certainly. Right. What I do is I'll pull it up here. Yeah. So we can swap over. Yeah, sure. To see what it feels like. Are you are you quite senior then, in in the so in the company? I've only been with Virtue now. I've been there for three weeks, so I've come from a different dealership. Oh, okay. So it's my third week here. And then they're giving you this one to start driving, yeah? Yeah. So obviously, with company vehicles, it's all about getting experience with the vehicles. Oh yeah, yeah. Okay. smooth like feels like I'm not even driving. Yeah. Okay. You just built for comfort, refinement. Yeah absolutely. And enjoyment. It's quite luxurious isn't it? Yeah. And then you have to stick a left just here. Memory seats as well. Yeah absolutely. Wow. Next left, yeah. Yeah, yeah I'm not going to lie, guys. The, yeah, the Range Rover Spot plug-in hybrid, this is 2024, is sick. That's all I can say. It's pretty sick. I'm very impressed with the infotainment. I mean, compared to the GLC, GLC has got that one there, but yeah, I don't think... You need more than this, really. Yeah, it's, it's a great system. Everything can be controlled on it. Right. Okay. The 
you guys have the what with the Mercedes they've got the MBUX where you can speak and voice commands. Same on yeah, Hannibal, Are we going one, right or left? Right yes. You've got voice commands with this one, yeah? Absolutely. Okay. So that if I was driving and I needed to ring, for example, my missus, I could, you know, say you can indeed. It, it's not switched on this one, but you can neither use Alexa or the Range Rover Intelligent Assistant. Exactly, that's what I'm saying. The Range Rover Intelligence Assistant, yeah. Because with the Mercedes, we have the MBUX. Okay. I'm pretty much new to Range Rover, so I'm just having a feel of it. And I've got made two eventually swapped to Range Rover from Mercedes. You know, so it's seeming like, yeah. It's very easy on the leg, I'm not gonna lie. Right. And what are, what are you guys hearing about the insurance? Because for some time now, there's been this news about high insurance because of theft and things like that. Yeah, so that's on the previous generation of Range Rover. Oh, I see. So okay. Range Rover are currently offering, if you do purchase one, but at the end of this month, they'll offer them up to £150 a month towards your insurance for three years. Are you being serious, yeah? But that does end this month. That's so fucking 